Okay, we can then progress the surfer on to actually looking at how we get up and move around the rook area, move around when there are bodies on the floor. Uh, so for example, all we're going to do, we're going to start almost as if we're in that surfer position again. What we're going to do this time, rather than just popping straight up, we're going to pop around 45 degrees. So from here, I'm going to pop into that position there. Okay, which in rugby terms is putting me into a rug style area. Notice how I lift my hips first. I'll show you again. The hips come up first and I try and rotate around the back. Hop, rotate into that position there. Now I'm using a tackle shield. If you're at home, you can use a cushion, you can use anything. It'll just help look after your chest a little bit as you go. So once you've got the idea of popping to one side, you're just going to add then a pop to the other, and then you can actually link them together. Do one left, one right. So what I might do is start here. Okay, down we go. I'm going to pop around to my left. I'm going to go back down, and then I'm going to pop back up and round to my right. And then you can add it if you want to do a bit of fitness. You might do sets of maybe ten, sets of five, however you feel, however you see fit. But the cool main thing is you get the positioning right. Okay, explode with your hips off the floor. Push with your arms. So you explode and look like you did on the surfer. Okay, and down we go. I'm going to pop one way, down, pop the other way, down, pop. You can even go all the way around and then back the other way if you want to. You then might want to add a ball. I don't know what balls you may have at home. Some of you may be lucky enough to have a rugby ball. Hey, you maybe got it for Christmas or whatever balls you've got, it doesn't really matter. Okay, we can use a little basketball. Mine's even a bit deflated. Just something that gives you a focus. So in rugby, the ball is clearly what we're after. When we've got it, we want to keep it. When we haven't got it, we want to try and get it back. Okay, so let's suggest, okay, I'm trying to get onto the ball here. I've potentially made a tackle. I'm going to pop up off the floor and try and get onto that ball. Okay, so down I go, made a tackle, pop up, and try and get my hands on that ball. Notice I have to look after my own body weight. I'll show you again. Up down, as if I made a tackle, bop, straight on the ball. Okay, head up and eyes up if I can. 